Welcome back again, Milks. In this video, we are going to deal with the second category of questions from the tropical cyclone, which are the location of semicircles of the tropical cyclones. I want to remind you about the diagram shown in the previous videos. Here we have a diagram of the tropical cyclone. The right of the path is called the dangerous semicircle, and the left of the path is called the navigable semicircle. So, you have the cyclone pile, the cyclone track, and the cyclone path where it is heading to. And also the cyclone trough line, we are going to make use of this diagram in most of the questions. So just get to know it. Let's go back to, let's start with one of the questions. The navigable semicircle of tropical cyclones in the northern hemisphere is located. So what you need to know is in the northern hemisphere and in the southern hemisphere, the movement of the tropical cyclone in the northern hemisphere and in the southern hemisphere. The correct answer here is to the left of the path. They said behind the ship, which is not correct. B said to the right of the path, which is not correct. C said ahead of the ship, which is not correct. And D said to the left of the path, which is correct. So we are going to use the diagram to explain why these options are not correct. So this is how the tropical cyclone looks like in the northern hemisphere. You have the dangerous semicircle and you have the navigable semicircle. And this is the path of the tropical cyclone. So if you go back to the equation now, the navigable semicircle of the tropical cyclone, which is this part of it, in the northern hemisphere is located. You can see it's located at the left side of the part of the tropical cyclone. So if you see behind the ship, there is nothing like behind the ship. <laughs> The shape B, to the right of the path, right of the path we have the dangerous semicircle, the northern hemisphere. Ahead of the shape, there is nothing like that. You won't know which of the, what it is, the, the tropical cyclone is coming from ahead or from the northern hemisphere or in the southern hemisphere. You don't use that to know if the navigable semicircle is located in the left or not. So the correct answer is to the left of the path. This is the navigable semicircle. And let's try another one again. The navigable semicircle of the tropical cyclone in the southern hemisphere is located as to the storm path. Select one A, I have B to the left of the path, C behind the storm, D to the right of the path. So the correct answer for this is to the right of the path. Why is this the correct answer? In the southern hemisphere, how does the tropical cyclone look like? Let's check out the diagram. So this is how the tropical cyclone looks like in the southern hemisphere. It's turning clockwise and it will look somehow to you, but you have the right part of the tropical cyclone at this side and you have the left on the other side. So on the left hand side you have the dangerous semicircle and on the right hand side you have the navigable semicircle in the southern hemisphere. So the correct answer is to the right of the path. This is right of the path as it is going down. Assuming if this turn to the north, you will have the right at this side and you have the dangerous semicircle at the left, but though it doesn't operate that way. In the southern hemisphere, winds turn clockwise and in the northern hemisphere, winds turns anti-clockwise. I think those are the two questions you will see concerning the location of the navigable semicircles in the tropical cyclone. Because you can take a picture of these two diagrams 
for the southern hemisphere and for the northern hemisphere to help you a lot. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next video.